Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of New on Steam. Today we're playing a little bit more Goobies. Still no upgrades, so we're going to hop in and we're going to get this a few more attempts. If I don't get any more upgrades, we'll probably end the series. And let's go ahead and hop right in. Let's go ahead. The point of the Let's Play is kind of is get first impressions and I I probably pretty much got a feel for the game. What uh, it offers in a basic uh, fundamental sense. And I don't want to spend 20 episodes to progress even further because I need a, a ton of upgrades. And uh, I like to see other characters, see what kind of the game has to offer. And uh, if it's not offering me really quickly, then no good for me, if that makes sense. <laughs> Let's go ahead and grab the Chain Lightning. Chain Lightning seems pretty good. Really hard to notice the effects on it because there's just so many enemies. And it doesn't really instant kill a lot of enemies, especially in the... Uh, the further stages. So let's go ahead and pop these goobies right here. I wonder if they're all goobies or am I just the gooby? The name gooby definitely fits the sense of uh, what my character is. <laughs> Very accurate description. If I think of a gooby, I think of my character. Okay, let's grab the chain lightning again for the passive. So we got double chain lightning. So I should be popping these early enemies fairly quickly. Okay. There is something satisfying about the the sound design in this game. <laughs> nice, relaxing pop. It's almost like ASMR. Wow, okay, we can get even more lightning. Um, let's grab the idle hands, though. So I can get uh, two shots, even though it reduces my damage. Uh, we still get a damage increase. And our combo meter is going up crazy, especially early on. Let's go ahead and grab all these experience orbs. Pop these goobies over here. Now these goobies, uh, I like this game because they, you have a sense of power in the beginning of the game and they really overwhelm you later, but you feel like you've progressed decently far. Let's grab uh, increased move speed. We're the first time we're ever grabbing move speed. Not that I feel like I need it, but there is an upgrade later that my damage increases based off my move speed, so it could be good. So a lot of this game is about damage modifiers and AE damage. Okay, let's grab the Chain Lightning. We'll grab health when we can. Luckily, uh, they move so slow in the beginning, we really don't have to worry about getting overwhelmed just yet. They do come out in a horde in a relatively fast fashion, though, once you get a little further in the game. Uh, there's a bundle of XP I really want to grab over there, so we're going to go ahead and take a wide berth and circle around. Okay, so we got the AoE enemies. We gotta be careful about the uh, big orbs because they uh, they explode and do AE damage. Let's grab Chain Lightning. We're just gonna do a passive Chain Lightning build, I guess. That's what the game wants, so that's what we're gonna do. Okay, grab all this XP right here. Still tons of XP right there. We gotta let them kind of hoard up a little bit over towards me a little bit. There we go. I think I got a window right there. Um, yep, yeah, okay, we'll grab, grab the Chain Lightning, and I guess, yeah, we maxed out Chain Lightning. That's the first time I've ever seen so many uh, items in a row of the same upgrade. So, we should be doing nice AE damage with the Chain Lightning in general, so we'll see how it handles the Elites later on, because the Elites is really what annihilates us. Uh, Dizzy Ball, let's go ahead. We're pretty much just grabbing the upgrades that are the highest tier upgrade that we can grab. It seems to be working out for us so far. Okay, so our combo meter is going down a little bit since we're not killing enemies as fast. Since um, we got a little bit more trickier enemies coming out right now. Ooh, we got a huge horde of them over here. So let's go ahead and come down here and start popping those. I like how the physics in this game, how they kind of push each other. Like they're in each other's way. <laughs> Okay, nice clump of XP right there. We're gonna grab the 0.5 damage for every HP lost because later we're gonna start taking heavy amounts of damage. I wonder if the explosions kind of hurt each other. It looks like it. So the chain explosions uh, from the orbs don't just damage me, they, they damage the enemies also. 
Okay, let's try to take a wide berth and try to grab all the XP again. We're killing quite fast for early game just because we have a chain lightning upgrade. We finally took some damage. There we go. This should give me a level right here. Uh, let's go ahead and do the passive chain. Not sure how effective that's going to be, but since it kind of affects individual enemies rather than a horde of enemies. And the percentage on it seems pretty low. But we never know uh, when you upgrade it how much more effective it'll be. Okay, so we got a boss finally. Let's grab the additional projectile. Whoa, this is a new boss. I wonder what he does. We're just melting him right now. Okay, so this is kind of bullet hell mechanics for this boss right here. I think this is the fastest we've ever gotten the boss. Oh! Okay, was not expecting that. And this is the fastest we're ever melting a boss right here too. Luckily, the horde of enemies aren't coming as quick. So we can really focus fire the boss. Okay, that's the fastest we've ever killed a boss, so I consider that some progress. Okay, let's see, we've got times two. Um, I don't know what that does. Okay, so we got orbs. Let's go ahead, attacks have 10% uh, chance to conjure a hailstorm for five damage each dealing six damage. Never seen that before. Enemies have a 10% chance to explode on death dealing six AOE damage. We're gonna do that because it chains really nicely. So if we can get a ton of that, we'd be pretty golden. Okay, let's go ahead and grab uh, as much XP as we can. Oh, that's strange. Usually we auto grab XP after defeating the boss, but that's fine. We can just go up and uh, grab it ourselves since there's no enemies around. Okay, let's go ahead to the second stage. Okay, it's going to take a second for the enemies to spawn so we can kind of get our bearings. The furthest that we've been is stage three, so we shall see how quick we get there. We are firing ultra fast right now, so this chain lightning build is doing us wonders. Okay, so uh, attacks have 1% chance to make you enter a frenzy state. Let's go ahead and enter, uh, use that. Although 1% chance is fairly low. It has to be kind of good though, because it is a higher tier item. I'm assuming it's better. Okay, destroy that orb right there before it damages me. Kind of clump all the enemies up. Uh, we're gonna take some damage here. Looks like we get healed up too after defeating a boss, not really sure. Kind of missed something there. Let's grab this XP. Okay, we're gonna grab the spikes this time. And looks like all the enemies are melting pretty fast. So it looks like it's nice to kind of focus one build one item so you can get max and it looks like we're doing tons of damage this way. This is probably the fastest we're ever killing enemies. Which is really nice. This game feels really satisfying when you can actually do that. Before we were relying kind of on uh, RNG of chain explosions at a very slow rate. But these things are kind of melting. We still need some damage modifiers so if we can grab like a 15% increase in damage I think would be pretty good. Uh, we're about to get surrounded right here, so attacks have a 5% chance to conjure a meteoroid. Uh, that'll stack well with chain explosion. Um, kind of trapped here. Okay, let's take some damage to get out. We took quite a bit of damage, almost two health. But I think it was worth it. Oh, uh, we're about to take some more damage. A chain explosion would be nice right now. Oh, we're taking massive amount of damage right now because we got cornered. That was my bad. Uh, I don't- I think we're still fine. Uh, we're still surrounded. We need to find a, a nice wide berth to get out and scrap this XP right here. Uh, we're gonna grab increase all AoE damage by 15%. I wonder if Chain Lightning counts as AoE. So I feel like I finally have a good build and we kind of, uh, kind of screwed ourselves by trapping ourselves. There you go, that's a nice clump of AoE damage right there. That's what I was looking for, really. Okay, attacks have additional projectile. Let's go ahead and grab that. So much free XP right here. It's taking a while for the enemies to spawn. Let's 
go ahead and kind of clear out over here. Looks like they're rushing from the other side though. So hopefully we don't get surrounded. Let's go ahead and try to circle around into a uh, wider area so I can have uh, more kind of area to disperse. Um, you gain 5% more experience. Enemies have a 5% chance to ignite. Um, let's grab the more experience. Which I should stack nicely with my passive upgrade that I get from uh, the main menu. Since this is a roguelike slash roguelike. Okay, let's not get cornered again. Even though there's tons of XP. Oh, I wasn't expecting them to blow up to a radius of other enemies. Even though I've played this game plenty of times. <laughs> Okay, chain explosions are going off really nicely. So let's grab all this free XP. Enemies have a 10% chance to release two worms on death, dealing three damage to all enemies that hit it. Don't mind if I do. Let's take the wide berth again. Killing tons of enemies really fast. Okay, gotta watch out for that enemy that kind of explodes in the smaller goobies. Let's grab all this XP right here. Uh, we're going to increase my damage by 15%, so we should kill even faster now. Gotta watch out for some AoEs. I think there's an elite on the field. Ow! I took some damage. Let's go ahead and grab all this XP up here from uh, earlier. I'm glad XP doesn't really disappear. Um, they're hoarding again really precisely over here. Some health regen might be nice, so we're gonna grab all this XP right here. Uh, we're gonna grab the chains again. And I'm not sure what enemy is shooting projectiles. It's not an elite, I guess it's just a basic enemy. Since they're coming out at a fairly slow rate. Ooh! Okay, there's a ton of them, I'm guessing, because there's a ton of projectiles. Ow, I'm getting hit. I got 0.4 HP left, so I can't get hit again. Some health regen might be some nice. Oh, we got this boss again. We gotta be careful. One hit will do it. But we're doing tons of damage this time. Okay, I think I got this. He's just uber melting. Okay, uh, come on. Health regen, maybe? So we got two times chains. So we're at the mercy of RNG for this kind of uh, ability. Uh, fire increased damage to 35% or fire additional projectile. Let's do increased damage again. This next, the furthest that we've ever been is stage three and it kind of melted us last time. So we shall see. I wish I was going in with a little bit more HP, but it is what it is. Okay. Now this island is a little tough because it's way smaller and there's a lot of uh, environmental blockage. Okay, so we gotta be careful. And um, our, yeah, our, we could have a little bit more attack range, but okay, we're screwed. There's no way out of this. And we got projectiles coming. So we need a really lucky chain explosion in order to get out of this. Uh, okay. So increase the damage by AOE. Attacks have a 2% chance to make you enter a frenzy. Okay, let's do the frenzy. You never know. Could save us in a pinch. So I can't believe we got out of that situation kind of nicely. Ooh, this AoE is nasty. These uh, projectiles. Our combo meter is going nuts, though. Glad the enemies are kind of melting. So we gotta watch out for this AoE up here. And we're trapped again. Just trying to guide them up here a little bit. Oh, we're completely surrounded. Hopefully I can do enough damage to kind of push my way out. Okay. So our chain explosion kind of uh, saved us there. 
gotta watch out for and push it. Oh, I got zero HP left. Uh, two chance percent chance to spawn chain lightning. Okay, so we can upgrade the chain lightning even further. So I have zero HP. That is crazy. Oh, wow. I can't believe I juked out of that. Okay, only if I didn't kind of screw myself earlier. I think we'd be in better position. Yeah, this chain lightning is clutch. Attacking so fast right now. Kind of just keep moving to kind of get ahead of the projectiles. Okay, um, let's grab more experience. Yeah, let's grab more experience. You never know. Um, we might get an upgrade for health regen. Oh, so close. Okay, that was probably the best that we've done in forever uh, since we played this game. Okay, if you guys like this episode, please leave a like and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Thank you.